tell you, the Mac is so fortunate to have you covering our shows here. There are very few writers who know how to write about music, and you do it spectacularly. Thank you so much for all your coverage. Congratulations on 10 years, and here's to 10 more. Hi, I'm Janie Sarther. I work here at the Mackinac Art Center, and congratulations to Natalia Diggenhart for covering 10 years at the Daily Herald and including the Mac in all your coverage. Happy 10th anniversary articles by Natalia. Bon chance, toy toy toy. Anniversary, Natalia. We're so pleased to have you come to our concerts and write articles so that you can spread our music to the whole world. We wish you many, many more years. Hope to see you at our next concert. Happy 10th anniversary to articles by Natalia. Natalia, you are an incredible writer. It's a function of your knowledge of music and what you write, plus your passion. Not everyone has those two things. Congratulations on 10 years, and here's to another 10. Hi, I'm Amber Broderick, General Manager for the DuPage Symphony Orchestra. We are thrilled to celebrate Natalia Dagenhart's 10-year anniversary of bringing beautiful articles and fascinating information to our DuPage community. And we're so grateful to have her attend our season concerts and share our music with the Naperville and surrounding audiences. So thank you, Natalia, and congratulations. Dear friends, my name is Natalia Dagenhart, and I'm the owner of Articles by Natalia Degenhardt. On November 11th, 2023, I celebrate the 10th anniversary of Articles by Natalia Degenhardt. I'm a former music teacher. I'm a former musician. I'm a former television journalist. I was born in the Soviet Union. I came to this country almost 22 years ago. I tried so many things. I got two more degrees besides my bachelor's in teaching music. However, I realized I can't imagine my life without classical music. So what should I do? I was just an immigrant. I became a citizen in 2007. And uh, I have an accent and all that. But if you love something, you follow it and you succeed. So I started writing to different orchestras, asking them, can I please write for you? Can I please attend your concert and write previews and or reviews of your events? Surprisingly enough, people started saying, yes, I had to prove I can do it. And I did. I love doing what I'm doing. For the last 10 years, I have been contributing my time, my effort, my talent, and my love for music. And I was writing articles, I was contributing to writing this articles, all that. You know, I am blessed. I have been writing for so many organizations during these 10 years including Lyric Opera of Chicago, Chicago Sinfonietta, DuPage Symphony Orchestra, Chicago Symphony Orchestra, New Philharmonic. I wrote about so many stars, musical stars, uh, opera stars, different musicians, singers. I met famous people. My articles were translated into different languages. I feel blessed every time I go to an event. I put music through myself. I, I live on the music and I just can't imagine my life without classical music, without musical events. And I believe that each of us should contribute their you know, time and maybe money by buying tickets and by attending concerts. The Chicago area is famous for good musicians, good educational and musical organizations, orchestras, schools, various musicians. They are waiting for you guys. 
I love music, I love writing. I combined it all together and I started writing about music. I really appreciate all of you, those people who read my articles. It's all online now. Daily Herald, Patch, my website. I used to contribute my articles even to the Chicago Tribune starting in 2013 and I finished in 2017 because they canceled, canceled all these uh, community contributions, so they didn't accept them anymore. So I really appreciate you reading my articles, giving attention to all what I'm doing. I love all our musicians, I support them, I like, I love conductors. And I love all the managers who organize all these events and artistic directors. And God bless you. Thank you so much. And we will stay in touch, guys.